which of the which of the infrastructure have been com ever completed? Even a uh, even a uh, a twenty kilometer road is never completed by them. So which infrastructure are they saying they are investing it on? And by the way, is life all about only infrastructure? What of the education that are killing? What happened to it? What of the salary you are paying somebody thirty thousand naira? And the dollar and the dollar is seven hundred naira. So how about the thirty thousand? That that thousand pay for transport. And they're not making Nigeria to be thieves. Somebody you are paying thirty thousand a bunt. A bag of rice is more than thirty thousand. You have devalued the naira. So what's the essence of paying somebody thirty thousand? And you are paying a senator how much? You are paying a rep, how much? You are paying a local government, you are paying a council, how much? The illiterate ones. How much are you paying a professor? You are saying you are paying a professor hundred or something thousand? For what? One thing is sure that we have been receiving all those money and uh, it's quite unfortunate they have not been utilizing it. There's one thing I want you to know. It would take a sound mind to utilize any fund that is assigned to anybody. In that case, I don't think what we have seen so far from the present administration, I don't think they, are, they will be able to utilize that money. No, 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 no. Because it will take a sound mind and somebody that carries the people at heart, that really wants to work, it will take that person, that kind of person is is the kind of is the right person that can utilize money when it comes to it it's all about managerial you, you know it's all about good management but we have not been seeing that we have been hearing about uh, last year they have they have returning uh, i think was it one country it told it over 500 million u.s dollars as an abachalo to this country that money has been swept under the carpet no the nigerian government the nigerian citizens do not know what the, where the money ends up to now so that money that the US, uh, uh, US government are returning to Nigeria now, I don't advise any other foreign nations to return every loot money and, uh, uh, from, from, from this country, looting money from this country or other country to be returning to the federal government again. What they will need to do is like, maybe like um, human rights radio, so for example, these are the kind of station and organization or the foundation, every reasonable uh, foundation that they return that money to, so that uh, they, those money can be given to the citizens. They buy the level of poverty in our nations now. Because the Nigerian government does not care whatever happened to the Nigerian citizen. Whatever some kind of money is looted out of the country now. Then they return it, well, return it to the maybe the agency and the organization or the foundation that can be able to dispatch this money to citizens to help them. Because right now, Nigeria is facing a lot of hardship. Nigeria, number one is the, 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 the high rate of, uh, of cost of living in this country is very high. Now, another thing that happened now, the issue of uh, transportation, which is increasing daily. Which are very issue that the Nigerian government is supposed to be attending to, but they're not ready to attend it. The last loot money they reduced, Nigerian government, the corrupt officials has, has, has shared the money among themselves. For me personally, I I believe when you return a um, looted uh, fund, there should be an effect, I mean, impact on the society, which should be positive. You understand? And, but over the years, we've seen Nigerian borrowing money again. You understand? So for me personally, I've not really seen the impact of this, you know, on the citizens, as in the society, precisely to be practically speaking. You know, we have uh, bad roads everywhere. We have, um, I mean, even if, let, let's just talk about social amenities generally, you understand? And you and I know this, that um, at least for days you have no lights and you know, we've not really seen the impact of this in the society. Let's just be patch out with ourselves. They are not using it. Is it not somebody? I was telling the uh, National Assembly that that might eat a voucher that they use, they spend 17 billion and nobody is talking. Is it not about somebody that will be telling you that the rat ate a many billion and nobody is talking? Is it not somebody that's two one hundred and something billion, only one person, and no man guaranteeing bill. And they said that uh, uh, bargaining, bargaining for what? The government is a fraud itself. The government is a fraud. They don't need to uh, uh, repatriate the money for now until we see the next coming government and the action.
to cut the story short, I think the best thing is just that, okay, fine. If an amount is um, being given back, I think that should be um, a kind of probably body or something. Let's even trace how the, the I mean, those ones that have been returned, how have they been uh, disposed or spent? Do you understand? And the public too, it's just so sad, honestly. There are things you think about in this country and you just go like, well, we give it all to God. I don't want to say more. This one will not make any difference. If I will advise US government, I will advise them to keep that money to the, the next coming government. There's no need to uh, repatriate the money back. And the people that are in government will now share the money and take it back to another foreign country. Honestly, honestly, I, we just at this point in time we just say we give it all to God. That, that's just it.